Shell Tron here. You can call me Shells, and I'm back, back, back at again with a brand new video. And I'm gonna keep it a bold, Bay biscuit. I need to know what Ian Rappaport just tweeted earlier this morning is an absolute lie from somebody who needs to get fired from their job. Throw the tweet right here. It says, while free agent Dwayne Haskins is unlikely to sign before the season, he is receiving interest from several teams. Sources said one of those is the Carolina Panthers, but there are others intrigued by Haskins. Let's break this tweet down in its sections, in its layers, like an ogre. First off, while free agent Dwayne Haskins is unlikely to sign before the season, stop! Unlikely? Almost damn impossible. I'm saying it's guaranteed this man does not sign before the season. I'm convinced this man has not learned a single thing about what it means to be in the NFL, let alone what it means to be a quarterback. So I'm assuming this tweet means before the 2021 season, which means all of free agency starting in what, February, March, honestly, and then before the draft, you know, in April, after the draft, you have OTAs, mini camps, preseason, God willing. No one gets hurt before then. No one calls Dwayne Haskins. And in September, when the season starts, no one wants Dwayne Haskins. That's believable to me. But then we get to the second part of this tweet where it says he is receiving interest. Stop. No, he's not. Third part from several teams. Stop. No, he's not. Who? Name one team right now. Name one team that is showing interest in Dwayne Haskins. Carry on, Ian. Source said, one of those is the Carolina Stop! Don't you say another word. You better say Carolina Hurricanes. Right now. Right now. Panthers? Stop! Why? Have we not suffered enough? Teddy at least is all right in the first three and a half quarters. And then he turns into Colt McCoy. Cardell Jones. Huh. If that. And you're saying the Panthers, in a year where we all understand where we're at in the draft right now, we're probably not in the running to get a quarterback in this draft. So finally, y'all can stop talking about that. premium do we get on Dwayne Haskins over Teddy Bridgewater or even PJ Walker? I'm not even 100% sure that this man Dwayne Haskins is worth more than Will Greer. At this point, what do we really get out of Dwayne Haskins? It makes no sense for the Carolina Panthers who still owe Teddy Bridgewater 20 to 23 million dollars next year to even bring in Dwayne Haskins. Think about it like this. Teddy Bridgewater is not a winning quarterback. Maybe you can have these guys on defense get better after this offseason and whatnot, coming to next year with a renewed sense of uh, progression and experience and other guys we add to the team. Maybe we do beef up our O-line. Maybe we do somehow extend Taylor Moten and Curtis Samuel. And we still have Robbie and DJ. Okay, but how much do you really believe in Teddy Bridgewater? But it's not just that. If Teddy Bridgewater were to get injured... And your next man up is Dwayne Haskins. How much faith do you have in Dwayne Haskins? This season is already dead. If Dwayne Haskins is your backup plan, then you may as well just have P.J. Walker or Will Greer. This whole tweet defies logic, but there's even more. It says, comma, but there are others intrigued by Haskins. Point them out. Which ones? I want proof, Ian. Name one team. Name one professional. Are you talking about XFL? I heard that XFL is coming back very, very soon. Are those the other teams intrigued by Haskins? I would believe that. What, what is others? Do you mean other teams? Do you mean others as in those strippers he brought to his cribbo? Just last week when he risked both getting and transmitting COVID-19 right after his head coach had just finished his cancer treatment? Do you mean those people, those respectable women of the night, are those the ones intrigued by Dwayne Haskins? Or are you actually referring to NFL teams when you use the words intrigued by Haskins? I just want to know. What exactly do you mean by that, Ian Rappaport? Because I'm a little bit confused as to why there's any interest. 
let alone interest by several teams, let alone why there's interest from a team like the Carolina Panthers who have no need for Dwayne Haskins. I wish we fired Marty Herney and our new GM decides as his first order of business that would be, without a doubt, the most Carolina Panthers thing to ever happen to the Carolina Panthers. Outside of picking up Matt Khalil for some wild and ridiculous reason, keep it real with you, I don't know what I would do if I woke up, saw the tweet, saw the notification on my phone. It might be time to get into soccer. It might be time to get into hockey. It might be time to find a baseball team. It might be time to figure out what it, what, what, what is cricket. I don't know what cricket is, but that might be my new sport. I, we, if we pick up Dwayne Haskins with a straight face, no takesies, backsies, no April Foolsies, nah. That's how I feel about it, man. What are y'all thoughts on Dwayne Haskins, the team picking him up? I could have spoken on Dwayne Haskins' stats. I could have brought numbers into this, but I don't have to. I don't want to. Let me know y'all thoughts in the comments below, and you already know what to do with that like button. Cheers to you, appreciate the chance. Being told y'all I been the man. Being told y'all I had the gift. Tell a friend, tell a friend. Real ones gonna recommend. Count this as another win. 